Introducing the new Apostle MagTouch 2000 Automated Magnetic Nanoparticle Nucleic Acid Extraction System. With an improved user interface and convenient compact size, this new system is efficient and easy to use. The programs will appear on the home screen. Select the desired program and press View. An overview of the program will appear, indicating where to place each plate. Use this as a guide to load the plates appropriately. There are now two options for loading the plates. The first option is to press the arrow buttons located in front of the sliding door in order to align the turntable to the desired plate position. The turntable will move in the direction indicated by the arrows. The second option is to press the desired plate position on the plate loading display. Once the instrument is loaded, press the run button to start the run. The system will verify the plates are in position before starting. As the program begins, the gripper will come down to grab the comb. Be sure to observe that the comb is securely attached within the gripper and properly removed from the comb plate. The table should then turn until the lysis binding plate, located in position 2, is stalled beneath the magnetic head. In this first step, the MagTouch is using varied vertical motions to mix the lysis binding solution within the samples to ensure proper sample lysis and binding of the nucleic acids to the magnetic nanoparticles. Once the mixing is complete, the magnetic head inserts into the plastic comb and proceeds to gather the magnetic nanoparticles, now bound to the nucleic acids. When the nanoparticles have been gathered, they are then lifted out of the plate. The shield plate will then move underneath the magnetic head to prevent any potential cross-plate contamination. The table now turns until the wash plate, in position 3, is stalled beneath the magnetic head. The magnetic particles are released into the 80% ethanol wash and mixed to remove impurities, such as proteins, that may also be bound to the magnetic particles. The magnetic particles are then collected from the first wash plate to be transferred to the second wash. The washing process is repeated in the second wash step, when the wash plate in position 4 is stalled beneath the magnetic head. Once this step is complete, the magnetic particles are removed from the wash and allowed to dry until the ethanol has evaporated. In the final step, the magnetic particles are released into the elution plate in position 8. The particles are vigorously mixed into the elution solution so that the nucleic acids can be transferred from the nanoparticles to the elution solution. This concludes the MagTouch 2000 Viral Nucleic Acid Automated Extraction. The nucleic acid samples can be stored at negative 80 degrees Celsius for long-term storage.